Hi guys, Mikey from Mikey Vlogs. In this video I'm going to be showing you all the accessories that I've placed on my bike so far. This is a Honda NC750S. So the latest addition to add to it is this touring screen by Puig, which is really, really handy to have, especially as it has about twice the coverage from the stock windshield. So as you can see there, yeah, that doesn't cover a lot, whereas that has a much greater reach. So not only um, does this really help, especially when you're going faster um, to stop the wind battering you, it's also given me space to put a rider scan, uh, which I really, really missed since having it on my Honda um, 600 FS. I do want to do a uh, shout out for Red Renner because she actually gave me her one as it didn't, have, as it didn't fit her bike, so a big thank you to her. That was really kind of her to do that. Um, yeah, so what this does is it covers all your uh, blind spots. Well, I, I say all, a lot of it. You still need to do your checks, but it, it just kind of gives you that extra awareness of what's around you. So if you've got a cyclist creeping up on you, um, you're going to be able to see them before you do your check, which is really handy to have. So the next thing is this here. This is a ram mount. Once again, really, really good little accessory to have because it allows me to mount an action cam on it so I can have it facing um, in front of the bike or I can point it towards me. Then we have the heated grips, Oxford. Um, yeah, not really useful for the summer, which is coming into, but really, really great to have in the winter. Also on the handlebars, I've got these uh, hand guards. This is done by SW Motec, and these are really solid. And they've got a nice design to them as well. So I really like those. You can see just how much uh, protection it covers from your hand. And then if I go down, I've got an RNG radiator protector or radiator guard. And to the side of that, the RNG crash protectors. This is gonna actually save or hopefully, <laughs> depending on the crash, um, more money than if you were to have th without them. So I would highly recommend these. These are these are solid, and it's going to add a hell of a lot of protection towards your motorcycle. And then on the rear, I've got a pyramid rear hugger. Uh, this is basically tied onto the rear of your bike with an industrial uh, cable tie. <laughs> um, in all honesty, I thought it wasn't gonna—I I thought it wasn't gonna last, but it's been a year since I've had it, and it's—it's um, it's keeping on strong. So, you know, hopefully it'll last longer. And uh, if it doesn't, I'll just get an official one. But at the time, I didn't have a lot of money, so that's why I went for this one. And it's done a great job so far. And then we have an uh, RNG exhaust protector, and of course, finally, the Akrovich exhaust. I've actually got the, the baffle removed from this thing just because it was too quiet and the reason for buying an exhaust was to be heard, uh, especially when filtering through traffic. So I've removed the baffle and the dealership did say that on this bike, with the baffle removed, it still is in within the legal um, legislation of the sound noise. So yeah, it's good. Anyway guys, thank you for watching and hope to see you in my next video.